they just, they're doing a disservice not just to basketball in Utah or basketball in general, but to jazz music. Like this is jazz. this is an affront to the art of jazz, jazz in general. Right. Like, I can't even listen to Coltrane the same now without thinking about this overrated ass team that every second we waste in the re- in a regular season talking about whether or not this year will be different for Utah. So tired of them. I'm tired of them. Listen, yeah. as much grief as the Timberwolves are rightfully so getting today, it could be worse. You could be the Jazz. You could be the Utah Jazz losing yeah. to Spencer Dinwiddie. No disrespect. Spencer Dinwiddie and Jalen Brunson at the crib oh, while Jaylen Luka Brunson's Doncic truth, plays cheerleader. No, he's really good. Hey, what is he got like hey, 72 hey, listen, points in one turnover in want, two games? You want to talk about if you want to call crazy. Jordan Poole, give him all you the money. call Jordan Poole a star. If you want to say he's he's headed towards stardom. So is this guy. So is this guy Jalen Brunson shout out and took a dirty hit yesterday had to leave the game for four and a half minutes came back and continued to do work. So back to back games gives them 41 and 31. Uh, not bad, not bad for Jalen Brunson. But let me let me talk about. I, the but Jets. I'll just say this real quick. I'll just say this real quick about uh, just to connect the Suns. If you think that they inevitably beat, yeah, Phoenix. Not even even inevitably. Excuse me, inevitably beat New Orleans or quickly beat New Orleans. You think it's, you think you think it's over? So you think it's Suns in five even without Devin Booker, right? Suns in five. Suns in five. Suns in five. Yeah. Okay. The Jazz look like they're done. I ain't giving them a fighting chance. They look they're, they're checked out. They're they're done. We've lost them. Okay, um, right. might not want to make it too quick because if Luke on the way back and the Suns see the Mavericks too soon, that can be problematic for for your sons as well. Okay, I wouldn't yeah, sleep on yeah, Dallas. I right. love Dallas coming right. into these playoffs. Remember, I kept bringing them up. Mm-hmm. I didn't know that they'd be up two one without Luca, but wow. maybe that says more about the Jazz and how fraudulent they are. See the Jazz, th- this mix, and I, I think it will change because. Uh, you know who's in in uh, in charge in Utah? I don't know what his title is there. Danny Ainge. His nickname mm-hmm. in uh, Boston was Danny Change. They just call him Danny Change because he like. I mean, he just really likes to make deals. Uh, he is not gonna. He's not a guy who's just gonna sit there and let things happen. So yeah. I don't know if it's with Quinn. I don't know if it's with Quinn Snyder. I don't know if it's with Rudy Gobert. He's gonna leave Donovan Mitchell alone. Donovan Mitchell staying. But something about the mix just keep sending them to the same kind of pattern. I mean, think about this. If they lose this series, which I think they will, that's be that'd be the third time in four years that they've lost in the first round. So they didn't lose in the first round last year, but last year was almost worse. Last year, they're the number one seed in the Western Conference. They're number one. We talked about them all year. I ripped them at the beginning of the season. I said, oh, the Jazz. Okay, yeah, nice little regular season team. They ain't gonna do nothing. They get into the playoffs. They do. They lose their first game to Memphis. They win four straight. Okay, here we go. Then they take on the Clippers. They take on the Clippers. Kawhi Leonard is out. Same situation. You look at it and say, oh man, the Clippers have to play the Jazz without Kawhi Leonard. Yeah. They lose four games to two to the Clippers, including they they blew some big leads. Clippers came out. It was just a mess. And here they are again with a team without its best player. And they're, they're down yeah. two and one losing this game at home. Like I'm just tired. I'm tired of watching them. I'm tired of their story. I know what's going to yeah. happen. The, if, they, if you bring this group back, you bring this group they back won't. to Salt Lake City. What they'll do is they won't. they'll win about 50. They'll win about 50 to 55 games in the regular season. Uh, they'll all talk about, hey, nobody pays attention to us. It's because we're in a small market. It's because we're the Utah Jazz, blah, 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 blah. And then they'll lose in the first and second round. Done. Get out of the way. Yeah, no. Change I, it I, up. I, like, break up, break up this band. Did you see that stat, though? I mean, 109 out of 121 three-pointers allowed have been open. 62 <laughs> wide open. Like, if that's not emblematic of just general disinterest in defense. I don't know what is that's that's they ought to be ashamed of themselves and meanwhile the Lakers are like, oh, we want Quinn Snyder. Do you <laughs> I mean, it's, it's like is that is I mean, do you, uh, that's not exactly the best job interview for you know for, for, for the Lakers if, if they end up going a different direction or remixing things with the jazz, but no nah, man. All I'm saying though is like Dallas. I like Dallas coming in. 
I, I did not. I did not. I thought they were in trouble without Luca against Utah. I remember you talked about. Yeah, I, I remember fell you for the banana about Dallas. Tailpipe with Utah. But you talked about Dallas, Dallas all year. Is, is not going to be easy for either Phoenix or New Orleans. Mm. Dallas is not going to be easy for either Phoenix or New Orleans. I'm just saying. Just say, okay, yeah. So you can't, let me, you can't let say let with let a straight me, face. You can't say so I, I'm not going to take you seriously because you let can't say it with straight. a straight I face. Need, okay, I need you to say this with a straight face as we go to break. Go ahead and roll the music, Gary. Just for the record, just as we go into this weekend, you're telling me that your sons against the field take and your sons are not in trouble against New Orleans who they just lost to at home and no Devin Booker. You don't want to walk even just a little bit. Either of those things. Well, Nothing. I, you have not, not come off of any hey, of those takes. I'm not going to be the Minnesota Timberwolves. I'm not looking too far ahead. So I'm going to stay right here in this series I'm in now. I'm telling you that the series I'm in now against the Pelicans, we, the Suns, Ooh, I can't we, wait till Monday. I can't wait. Oh, till we Monday. happy. Oh, oh, we I can't wait no, till Monday. <laughs> we happy. We I happy. Can't wait till Hey, thanks for watching Brother From Another on YouTube. Make sure you hit subscribe before you leave and be sure to watch us 3 to 5 p.m. Eastern Time on Peacock. Appreciate you.